Hi, just a quick update to show you how to use the mobile app as an employee to clock in and out. Uh, I'm using an old iPhone. The process remains the exact same if you're on iOS or on Android. And let's jump right in. So once you log in, you land up on your diary view, which is the main screen where all your punches are captured. The clock in, clock out, you can see. You can see the work duration and so on on this screen. Now, if your admin has allowed you to clock in and out using the mobile device, then you will find the option from the top left side and we have the punch in button. You can see that there is a camera icon next to it. That's because my ad admin requires that uh, I take a photo every time I clock in and out. Now, what I do is I simply click on punch in and I can click on add a photo and I'm just going to click a photo very quickly. Just give me a moment. And there we go. And then uh, it says you're not allowed to punch in from this IP address. The reason is the admin has said that I'm only allowed to clock in and out from certain IP addresses so that you can see at the bottom of the screen which IP addresses are allowed. We also capture the location at the time of clock in clock out. You will be able to see the allowed locations from the location list. It also shows you how far you're from that location. And if it says OK, that means those locations are allowed. We also check the GPS accuracy. So it says 6.95 meters. This is again set by our admin. We allow for both meters and miles. So it says it, it basically shows you how accurate your GPS signal is to clock in and out. And if the IP address has matched in my case, I would be able to punch in and out. Let me very quickly enable that from the settings. All right, so there we go. So now I've, en I've enabled it. Now I'm just going to capture the photo once again. And there we go. And now I'm able to punch in. Now, as I mentioned earlier, you'll be able to see all the clock in clock outs on the screen. You can see that I've clocked in at 12.41 p.m. and it shows the photo that is captured at the same time. Now, the photo capture, the IP address and the location are all optional and these are set by your admin. 